Welcome to another J Crazy News headlines and a special Saturday evening to those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers, when it comes on to badness, these youths are hard of hearing. They not take telling. And they always end up being murdered in such a very barbaric way. And the key right now is Malik. Now, earlier uh, today, Malik was found in a section of Rose Town, Wooden Avenue, in a very, very difficult state. Unbearable state to the eye. I never seen such barbaric killing before. Now he was found with his half of his face gone. You could see his T-E-E-T-H and also his E-Y-E. -E. It's like these criminal elements use whatever and P-E-E-L of a section of his face. Data information he said that Malik recently came from behind the bars and was warned not to venture back into the streets. Stay away from the streets because your image in the streets is not good. But these youths never take telling. These youths had to hear them stubborn. The only time they listen or have regrets is when the gun of a rival or enemy is staring at their faces. And they could only say to themselves, had I listened. This was one of the most barbaric killing in Jamaica's history. But you know what? There will be more killings far worse than this. Because our youths, they don't listen. They don't heed the warning before their life is snatched away. You could have preached like Paul, like Jesus, like all the disciples in the Bible. And these youths do not take telling. Instead, them fan you off and tell you if you go away. They don't want to hear that. They are real chatter in the streets. They are rating stall. Nobody can touch them so easy. Them ever strap. Them friends have them back. And most times, them friends are the ones who help to set up their demise and give the enemy or the rival information on their whereabouts. So youths in Jamaica, get a youths, does badness worth it all? Is badness beneficial? Because the way I see it, badness all in Leeds, get the youths and youths in Jamaica, youths in the black community overall, to get a first class ticket to board hell your ways and join Satan in hell to become his slave. So think wisely on the life you live because you only have one life. And how you live it at the beginning will result in your ending. Get to youths, these are words of warning. The picture is all over social media of how this youth died so barbaric. But guess what? Once you join the underworld of criminality, it is hard to come out of it unless you have God on your side. And even when you have God on your side, the enemies still come at you. Now, as I said before, he recently came from jail. It's alleged that Malik a.k.a. Ralph shot a man who is from Pearland and the man who got caught up from Pearland by Malik. Friends heard that Malik was in 
was stoned. And they went for him. And you heard the results of how he died. Now we head towards overseas in Philadelphia, aka Philly, where tonight is the one other than birthday party, Bon Man Brother Plucker. Now, Plucker, let me ask you something. It seems as if you love the arms house. It seems as if you love to get shot at or shot. Because every time you keep a party, criminal elements always attack. Either in the party or after the party is over. And you know, Roto is at the head of these attacks against Plucker. So, I'm pretty sure tonight you will see Roto in full attendance with gun attack. But I have to know something. Who grant these criminal elements permit to keep these parties in Philadelphia? I would love to know who that the right man would allow their place, their venue to be available to these criminal elements because for sure the persons who have these venues will know that these criminal elements have rivals and the arrivals will, with no doubt, launch attack. So, Plucker, look like you love the arms house. You love to be shot at or shot. And you know Roto wants you dead badly. So every time he goes up against you, Plucker. Plucker, haven't you had enough of being shot at or shot? By your arch rival Roto. You know, look so at all. The last party you kept earlier in this year, your right hand stone got shot in his eye, which was a party, a memorial for your brother Bonman. And Roto launched attack at that venue after you came from the party. So, Blocker, you still are going to be a target for Roto again? After the last attack? I tell you, these criminal elements, they amaze me. They really do. They live their life so reckless. Reckless indeed. But when you're a gangster, you know, you cannot expect anything other than being reckless and carefree of your life and others around you. To the selectors on this party, on this poster, I hope you can duck. I hope you can scale fence, or bore through the wall, or kick on the door, or dive through the window. Because, trust me, a party like Plucker Party is definitely trouble. And I smell trouble from early. Now we head toward Sentan and also Chilani. Boy, may I tell you, bad mind is a hell of a thing. And in Jamaica, bad mind is active to the full length. When it comes down to bad mind, you have to refer Jamaicans in the mix. It's only a small amount of Jamaicans will be happy for other persons' achievement. On the screen right now is Nigel Ling, who is from Sentan. Now, sometime last week, he was poisoned by a co-worker at this popular hotel in Chilani. All because Nigel got a promotion. Can you imagine this young man's life was snatched away by a co-worker, jealous co-worker, envious co-worker, all because you get a promotion. You would work hard for him promotion, he got it. And this co-worker, this bad man crabbing a barrel co-worker, poisoned the man. To the police, I hope 
there is a full investigation in this matter. And the co-worker who is responsible should be jailed for murder. People in Jamaica, be mindful who you am from. Be mindful who take things from to eat. Your co-workers should always remain your co-workers. They are not your friends, nor your body, nor your pal, nor your hombre. They are your co-workers for a reason. This young man was murdered, poisoned, murdered by a co-worker. Because the youth worked hard and got a deserving promotion. Most Jamaicans are not happy for your achievement. It's only a few. It's only a handful. But the masses, boy, may I tell you, it's nothing pretty indeed. Nothing pretty indeed. This is Jay Crazy. Once again, until then, this is Safe. Saturday evening. Yeah man, I'm here to see a black legend. I'm here to represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So watch, like, comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements are free. Jay Crazy not play with him and review the thing then. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements are free. Jay Crazy not play with him and review the thing then. Review the thing, then review the thing, then Jay Crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle Review the thing, then review the thing, then Jay Crazy